Ted is the guy with the sunglasses on. So we are ready for some great rock and roll music. You know, as a matter of fact, guys, Tony, you just composed a brand new song. And I'd love you to just premiere it right here on the Homegrown Radio Show. Would you do that? The one that you just composed in the in the sound check that would be so awesome. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, uh, sure. Okay, good. Let's go for it. Tony and uh, Brad are going to do the vocals, and Chad's going to accompany me on drums. Here we go. The, the newest composition by Ten Pan Nail. Scoot up, 
Megan's with the the band tonight, and she's kind of their public relations spokesperson, obviously. Also, happen to be Brad's girlfriend. It's it's Ashley. Ashley, Megan, <laughs> Megan's my hairdresser. Better be better better you make that mistake than me. You better not. Quite all right. Megan's my hairdresser, and she was on my show last night, so or to Monday night. So I, I've got Megan on my. So just text me. Ashley, what's your last name? Morrison. Ashley Morrison, who is an absolutely beautiful addition to this rough, tough <laughs> rock and roll band. But you've been. You've been around the band for a while. Lean in just a little bit. But tell us about your experience listening to these guys play. Well, I've been dating Brad for almost eight years. Wow. Wow. <laughs> so um, I've been listening to, listening to him and his dad play for years. But they just got the band together about a year ago, so I'm really excited for them to finally be together. And it's great to have along too. Oh, that's fantastic! Well, you can pop in anytime you want to say anything. Chad, Chad looks like, like a happy kind of guy. Yeah. Pretty yeah. Pretty much. He's Gotta yell over the trap kit so we can get to that microphone. Well, Brad, you're the spokesman, and I remember you. Well, actually, I could make Tony the spokesman, but I'll do either. Um, Tony, now I gotta talk to you first. Um, I remember you from way back when. And I'm thinking in the middle 80s, maybe, you were doing some stuff with the crew from WHAS 11. Yeah, we were doing bluegrass music all those years. And I appeared on WHAS and ABE and almost every local station around. I bet, and you did some really special stuff with some of the famous names. Oh, of yes, local yes, music. yes, yes. We, we played a, a job one night. Uh, oh, it's been so long ago, it's hard to remember, but it, the, the whole Halo of Hopedown gang was there for a big river cruise on the Bell of Louisville, and uh, we were the warm up band. But, but it had the whole Hale Off Hope Town Gang and part of the John Schrader combo. Wow. Was, Randy and memorable night. A bunch. Just a big, big memory now, you know, it was uh, before the set today. That's right. <laughs> That's when they used to inscribe it by a stylist to a disc, right? Uh, that's it. Pretty amazing. Well, I really appreciate you guys being able to be here with us tonight. And there's more equipment in this studio than ever exists when I have to take it from Tara on Monday night. So it's really cool to see a full-size band set up. Brad, talk to us a little bit about how you guys formed this this light night. Well, we just were bored and like playing music and kind of, you know, I wanted to get him out of the grind of bluegrass, you know, uh, he, he did, there was a shooting incident in his last band, you'll have to get back at him Good after Lord. a show sometime, but oh, yeah, 
Yeah. They, smoke. Yeah. Uh, uh, hell, 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 it's, it's, yeah, it's still <laughs> a sensitive subject, but I do believe the bass player unintentionally now shot the banjo player's oh, life in the no. face. It was, oh, it, it was a ricochet. No. It was a ricochet. <laughs> but it was unintentional. That's the most important. Now they, they do call the guy a killer, though. I <laughs> can't even imagine. I was hoping that it wasn't the Hatfields and McCoys that you were involved in. We're rednecks. <laughs> <laughs> well, Tony, um, really, it's it's. Great that you guys are here, Brad. It's great. And I want to just give you free reign to play. Um, Crescent Hill Radio is a 501c3 public radio station supported by your donations at crescenthillradio.com. And you're welcome to log on to our website at any time and join for just. $25. You get a t shirt. They're great. We would, we would absolutely love to have you join us because we have great groups like this. So many different shows that go on uh, all week and lots of great hosts and lots of guests. So Christy, we are thinking about you tonight. We know you're at home listening as you look in your ice pack trying to get your back working again. We're going to kick off the show right now with Ten Penny Nail and give them a shot at playing some of their best. So what are you going to do first there, Brad? I believe we're going to do a, a Mitch Ryder in the Detroit Wheels number called Shake Your Tail Feather. So maybe you all can get out in front of the camera and shake your yeah, tail. Yeah, we'll let Ashley do that. She's, she's dressed and ready to go. Okay, good job. Ten penny nail. All right. Right. <laughs> 
shown mm-hmm. it here on Crescent Hill Radio, which we love because we feature only local and regional bands, and we 